Hi, my name is Kathy Gillespie. I am doing a project for Network Securities and we are going to be doing some information gathering. I have already downloaded Montego, uh, Maltigo, excuse me, onto my desktop. Um, when you do this, there is a free version. It's called the Community Edition. Um, and they, you can select whatever operating system that will work for you. So once you get that downloaded, there's several things that you can choose from, actually many things that you can choose from, and we'll just walk through a few. Up here at the top button, um, just click on New. Um, at this point, um, I'm pretty familiar with the mining view. That's, that's the view that I like, but you can play around with it. There's several different views that you can use. Um, at this point, um, I'm going to be going with some email addresses. I think I'm going to use my email address from school and see what I can find from that. So I type in my email address. There it is. And we, when to run um, or gather any information, Maltigo um, names this Run Transform. So everything, you go to all the transforms and it gives you a list um, of things to go by or to choose from, rather. And at this point, I am going to the domain DNS server. See what I get. There we go, Davidson Community College. And at this point, let's see. And always highlight this, uh, and then you can dig deeper. Um, that will let you know that you're trying to dig deeper into this particular site. Um, from the Run Transforms, and we go to All Transforms, I'm going to come down and see if I can get on to the uh, Davidson Community College website. Let's see what this will do. There is the Davidson County Community College website. Let's dig a little deeper here. And go with the DNS website of Davidson Community College and see what this brings up, if anything. There we go. Let's see what we've got here. Now the views here that I was speaking about earlier, this is the dynamic view. Uh, this is a pretty little view. Um, entity list and it just goes that way. So whichever view that you prefer. Um, at this point, let's see what we found. We have found the DCCC logic, the blackboard, jobs at DCCC. And you can move these around. Let's see what we've got. Let's go on Blackboard. Or actually, let's go on the job site and see if we can dig any deeper in there. Actually, you can. Let's go to this view. So now we've got the jobs. Let's go back to the mining view. And trying to run. Here we go. There we go. Okay. Jobs at DCCC. Let's see what we can bring up from there, if anything. Let's 
Let's go to the domain and see if that brings up anything here. I don't think. Let's try something different here. Um, there again, run transform, all transforms. Um, did it just bring something up? Let's try the website. Note that this transfer site will make a connection to port 80 of the entity. Um, I'm not sure that I want to do that. I'm going to cancel, but if, as you can see, playing around with this, you have got so many different things that you can do. I am just afraid to, di to dig into this too deep. If you go on to Blackboard, let's find the Blackboard account. Here we go. See what we can do here. Run transform, all transforms. We're going to go to uh, DNS. Let's see what we bring up. Here we go. Blackboard. Um, IP address. We could try to the website, replace with thumbnail, incoming site. Let's um, try the incoming site that links to that site. Well, as you can see, we have played around with this, and you can just go on and on. Um, and that concludes my project for information gathering with Maltigo.